Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke, also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. May the 4th be with you. I'm at Centre MK for Collector Mania. It's back where it belongs, at Milton Keynes. I haven't been to Collector Mania since it was at the NEC um, two years ago where I met Jodie Whittaker. And having it back here is unbelievable. And it's just on my doorstep, so I'm well happy about it. But you know the drill. <laughs> no full English today. I've opted for a bacon roll with brown sauce. You've got to have brown sauce from Greg's, which is literally right next door to where the event is. Not a massive event, but I'm really impressed with uh, what they've put out here. I mean, I got, I got here really early, so I was here for nine o'clock. So, so, so it wasn't packed. There wasn't um, loads and loads of people hanging around. But honestly, I, I'm really, really impressed. The, the stalls were great. Um, the stuff for sale was great. Um, everyone was in a uh, Star Wars mood and I was in the mood for a Star Wars hunt. So honestly, and also it's free. I mean, can you believe it? I didn't think it would be free. And I was concerned with the event being for free because <laughs> there's, there's a certain element of riffraff who live in the uh, Milton Keynes area. So I was a bit concerned that, <laughs> that they might be there, but I didn't see any of them. You haven't got, have you got Twisted Bonnet? Dad, you keep saying that we have that one. Oh, did I get, oh, yeah, I got that for you. Yeah. You haven't got that one? No, that's, yeah. Yeah. that's 28 pounds. That's the only ones, oh look, they got Halo as well. <laughs> From the show about the slow collector, I don't, you've never seen it. I didn't even know what it is. Oh, so it was, I, I used to enjoy it, it was a good show. That looks amazing, that does. Star Trek figures there. Yeah. 
do I do like these uh these old school ones. What a wonderful event! Um, really enjoyed it. Uh, I was I was being mindful with uh, with my money. Um, I I only I only picked up a few bits, which were all from the um, Phantom Menace um, original line, including TC14, which I've always wanted, and this was in immaculate condition. Let your eyes be a guide. And then afterwards, because we we're in a shopping mall, we hit the shops. I've got to be honest, HMV's been a bit poor recently. The one in St. Evanage has been rubbish the last, well, since I started working there. Not really any great stuff in there at all. And it was the same in uh, Milton Keynes. It's just the usual suspects. Um, and a lot of this stuff you can get cheaper in Lame. Lame had a good selection. Not bad prices. Um, I mean, you've 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 got the uh, the Hoff Luke five pounds, but then you've got the newer vintage collection um, with Finn and also um, Andor, and they're like thirteen pounds each, which um, that's not a bad price. It's not a bad price for a a recent addition to the vintage collection, but it's still too much, <laughs> in my, in my opinion. But um, Lane was better, and they they still had the old. Uh, oh yeah, this is the this is the um, you know the, you know the Chewbacca's brother. I can't even say his name. I picked this up in uh, in Target, so um, that that review's coming soon. But yeah, um, Lane they were still selling the Black Series figures like the Jawa and the Officer, five pounds. Um, off to Menkind as well. My son liked these. Um, they look like Funko Pops, but they're not. They're not made by Funko. I don't really know much about them. Thirty-five pounds each, but they're kind of flocked, similar to. Um, sim similar. My son did buy a, a flocked um, Funko um, Funko Pop from Smith's Toys ages ago. But also similar to Mossman, the Mossman that I picked up in uh, Walmart. So yeah, they're they're very nice, but um, I do think. £35 is a bit of a joke. But it's, it's great that you've, you've um, as part of the, um, uh, as part of your visit to Milton Keynes to the uh, Showmaster Collector Mania event, you've also got the shops. I mean, and the shops are really good. I do rate um, Centre MK. And then you've got the, uh, was it the Midsummer Place? The new bit, as they call it, next door. I've got to get myself one of these Clone Trooper helmets. Um, I think I've seen them on um, Amazon uh, for ninety nine ninety nine. I, I don't I, I don't want the Ahsoka one. I just want the bulk standard Phase Two. I also want that Biker Scout helmet as well. Uh, but that'll be for another time because um, I, I don't currently have to cash the splash, and I don't have the room. And then the Lego store um, that it was it, it, they were really going for it for. Uh, May the 4th, um, the, the, everyone was queuing to get their free um, build a figure. So you could actually build a figure in there. Excuse me. Oh, yeah. You got the inside the back? Uh, yeah, X Wing, yes. Let me double check. Yeah, you can. Get 
get away from that, see what we've got. Yeah, open it up, um, be careful though, because I know the pieces are loose in there. What, what figure is that? So all that shopping and toy hunting obviously made me hungry. So we decided to go to Nando's. I haven't been to Nando's for about six months. I also didn't know that Saka had his own Nando sauce. I'm going to use some of, some of this sack up. I didn't know. I didn't know he had his own. I knew. I knew he, spo he was sponsored, but I didn't know he had his own um, Nando sauce. Really happy with my purchases. TC14, I've always wanted it. I was aware it was gonna um, go live on the uh, Disney Store website from the uh, Droid Depot, their own Disney version. Um, even Chuffy Futter sent me a message about it. Got home, absolutely sold out. I'm absolutely gutted. I really wanted to uh, pick up a TC14 from uh, uh, the Disney Store, but that, that's not gonna happen. Still, avail still, still available in the United States and also Europe. But not the UK, um, but yeah. But I'm not going to let that um, dampen my uh, May the Fourth. Honestly, I've had a, I've had a, a great time. I hope this is the uh, start of something big, because um, Collector Mania. It's always been a great event. It was so sad when it left Milton Keynes. I think they fell out with uh, the MK Dons over it. But it's good to have it back. Uh, that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel. May the fourth be with you, and I'll see you in the next one.